Will, yes, can I interrupt you for a sec? Please. But can you, you speak more directly towards our higher levels that are us and, and how they're orchestrating things for us? Because it's it's such a, a broad concept to move beyond, you know, that everything is is being provided for us as opposed to we're creating it. Well, it's actually very easy. This is going to be your heart, the atriums, the ventricles, and so forth, right? This is going to be the aorta. Now, have you ever contem contemplated what makes that beat? What makes it take in oxygen and remove gases? What literally, what in heavens, what either keeps that? Palpating. I mean, really, pff, what even gave the body these jumper cables to let the heart level, the atriums, the ventricles, the pericardium working? Um, let's be very literal. Your body's just an organism, period. We can call it an instrument, we can call it fun. Let's skip all that, let's forget about all that. Being an instrument, being a conduit, has everything to do with what you do with it. What you let it become. What lets that heart, physically speaking, have life? And I mean this literally. We can call it nervous systems, we can call it central nervous system, parasympathetic, autonomic, sympathetic. Uh, parasympathetic like I was sharing, what lets that heart level take in oxygenation, taking in blood flow, purifying blood flow, go all the way through the veins, the venules, arteries, to create life. We'll call it health, vibrancy. What lets that happen? And where did even the Kickstarter come from? Because I know you didn't come out with jumper cables. <laughs> okay. It's, it's too vast for me to even contemplate. It's called you. You as your higher levels. Higher does not mean way out here. Right. It means right here. Right here. Because we can go into chakra level vortexes, we can go into meridians, we can go on and on and on. Let's go right through. We can, you hear all these terminologies, the heart of hearts, on and on and on. We hear the term soul levels, creator levels. But really, let's go right into the epitome of you. Because there's a pericardium, but quite literally, beautifully, it's the hue that gave that the first jump start as you entered it through the caves of creation and so forth. Well... This is you as your higher level. So many call it auras and all that, but it's actually your own essence. They gave the body principle the kickstart. Higher is not way out here. It's the velocity in which your body oops. is let to vibrate. And I say let beyond the mental, the causal, the emotional realms. So when I say, all right, body vibrate faster, I'm letting it, not allowing it. I'm letting it do its part for me. 
Now, we're going to open, open, open to all that is. To let the velocity of the physicality open, 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 faster and faster is the vortex of consciousness that you are. Your higher levels are not separate from you. It's actually who you are. But yet, there's you right here, right here, and then there's this beautiful barrage. Here's you as well. Then there's this beautiful barrage called thoughts, called judgments, we'll call them decisions, called emotions that come with all that, that actually create the decisions to be made. And it looks like this. These are what you'll call judgments, beliefs. With energy. To become locked and anchored in the place. That's an anchor. To create a, creates a solidified physical form to become polarized, densified, and separate from you. Which now we have the beginning of the first segregation separation called symptomology and illness. And we can call it the absence of you, we can call it the absence of enjoyment, the absence of joy, the absence of bliss, the absence of abundance. Of all areas, the absence of love, the absence of brilliance, the absence of exuberance, exhilaration, the absence of life, the absence of your natural birthright. And then you can surrender to you, wow, everything will automatically open up. You hear me talk so much about control, you hear me talk about manipulation, you hear me talk about domination, you hear on and on, they all come down to agendas. Without agenda, you have freedom. Without judgment, you have you. Without control, you have absolutely eternity.